So on our podcast and on one of my YouTube videos, I made a comment about how I thoroughly love waking up to myself in the morning and how amazing it is and how grateful I am. Well, this week something happened where I became quite critical of that comment and felt like, well, maybe I shouldn't be saying that because it's a little too much for people. And I've worked hard to be too much, I guess. I mean, that sounds backwards, but all of this is so backwards. Um, it's okay for someone to say, I'm so grateful that I get to wake up to Joe every morning. Like he's so amazing, but it's not okay for us to say that about ourselves and be grateful. Like if someone was waking up next to Joe and they comment about it on social media, everyone's like, Oh yeah, that's awesome. Congratulations. Like he's really quite the man, blah, blah, blah. But if they said that about themselves, people would be very judgmental. And it's like, why can't we feel that way about ourselves? We're taught to feel that way about other people. And we expect other people to feel that way about us, but we can't even feel that way about ourselves. It's backwards. It makes no sense. So anyway, it's like the, uh, the naysayers and the, basically when people don't understand something, they criticize. So if you don't understand what it feels like to feel really good in your own skin, then you're going to criticize it. And you also have to understand what it feels like to feel really bad in your own skin, to appreciate how good it feels to be in your own skin. So it's not that you just wake up and are like, oh, I'm so amazing. It's I'm going to put the work in every day until I do feel great in my skin and until I'm, I am grateful to wake up to myself every morning because you are going to wake up to yourself every morning until you don't and when you'll be dead but wherever you go after that you're still going to have to be with yourself so I just love feeling good who doesn't who doesn't so if you want to like put yourself in a lower spot so that you don't get criticized, you're going to get criticized regardless. So it's the, it's like I said, the people that don't understand, it's not personal. It's, I don't understand. So I'm going to act out like this and I'm going to say this. And it's like, oh my gosh, Becky, do you see what Amber said about herself? Like she's so obnoxious. And she has really small boobs, so no wonder why she wakes up by herself every morning. A little extreme, but basically it's, I don't understand it, so I'm going to put them down. And then I'm going to validate to myself why they don't, validate to myself why I think they shouldn't feel that way about themselves. Make sense? And even if I do have small boobs, I love them just the way they are. I think they're perfect. So that's what matters is that I think I feel this way about myself and I'm going to continue to be honest about how I feel about myself. And I've had some things come up this week about validation and that word's been coming up in my meditation where I was seeking validation and we've all, we all seek validation and we all have seeked it at some point in our life. So I had to really hone in on what areas I was seeking validation in. And sometimes it's hard to decipher, okay, well, am I being truthful with how I feel or am I seeking validation? And with that comment, I am 100% truthful. And I feel, and I'm not going to tell anyone how they should feel, but I would love it if everyone did wake up that way and feel amazing to wake up to themselves every single day. How do you expect someone to wake up feeling that about you if you don't feel that way? 
Like they might for a little while, but after a while, it's going to be like, oh my gosh, I'm just so grouchy in the morning. Like I don't want to wake up next door anymore. Do you see what I'm saying? Okay. Anyway, I just wanted to get that off of my small chest and out there into whoever's ears wants to hear it. Don't down yourself. Don't dumb yourself down. Say how you feel about you. And if it's not so great, still say it. It feels good to get it out. It's okay to say something that you don't like about yourself so that you can understand it. Get it out of your head and out into like acknowledgement, basically. Acknowledging something that you may not like so much. It's okay. It's okay. It just wants to be acknowledged and heard and then you're able to love it from there. So anyway, happy Friday. And I am definitely, if I have another night on this earth, grateful to be waking up to myself tomorrow and going to bed with myself tonight. So have at it.